Uh, we didn't reach the level that we needed to today. And it's, it's something we haven't really leveled at them recently because they've been on a good run of form. But we didn't reach our levels technically. Um, and physically, I didn't think that we, we reached the levels we needed to do today. Um, and it doesn't help any game when you give a, someone a three-goal start. Yeah. Do you feel that they didn't step up at all? I, well, I wouldn't say that. I, I think that we found a way to uh, compromise ourselves. Yeah. Uh, and giving ourselves that much to do by being three down so early yeah. it was really, really difficult. So that's something to take into consideration. But there's no point now in, in mm -hmm. throwing things at them at the moment. They're, they're in too... Um, too fragile a state. I hesitate to use the word fragile, yeah. but the the state that they're in at the moment isn't something that's conducive to learning. Mm -hmm. So we'll take a reflection, we'll take a breath, and then we'll talk about it in the week. Lessons that we can learn. You say they're fragile. They're a very young side. Can they gain anything from this game? Well, you actually learn a great deal from games that you lose. Um, there's no point winning every game five, six, seven nil. But what you do have to learn is the things that they did really well that we'd like to take into our game, but also where we compromised ourselves because we didn't actually turn up and play our A game today and we need to find out why. And when they learn that, it will stand them in really good stead for, for later on in their career.